Last year, I created a video discussing Qtfish OS and Qtfish Desktop. I had mentioned the unclear state of its development and its future. It seems like they have now returned with numerous bug fixes and improvements. This is Qtfish OS 2023, a stunning Linux distribution that you need to try right now. It's a beautiful Linux operating system aimed at delivering a simple user experience. Qtfish OS is based on Debian 12, granting you access to a large collection of packages and software. The core parts of Qtfish OS include the Qtfish desktop environment, window manager, control center, launcher, and dock. Its modern-looking desktop environment gives a different taste of the desktop experience. The bottom dock provides a convenient place to access the application and its features. Now this simple dock can be expanded and hidden as needed. Now let's take a look at the control center. It's all-in-one control center that makes it easier for users to access and manage various aspects of the system. Qtfish OS wins the hearts of every Linux user. If you visit one of their websites, it clearly states the development of Qtfish OS based on Debian 12 is still in beta. Now, as a result, you might notice minor performance issues. Now, fortunately, Qtfish team has made their desktop available in Arch repositories. Now, therefore, trying the Qtfish desktop with Arch Linux is recommended. All you need to do is download the latest Arch installer script and follow the on-screen instructions to set up the Qtfish desktop. Arch repositories have the latest builds of Qtfish desktop providing an almost bug-free user experience. I noticed that installing Qtfish desktop on top of Arch Linux is much better than using their distribution. You may notice numerous improvements, bug fixes, and minor UI updates. Take a look at the brand new wallpapers, they look next level on large monitors. Overall, I must say I'm uncertain about the future of Qtfish OS due to the insufficient funds of maintenance. However, at least the development of the Qtfish desktop is back and active. I hope they continue refining Qtfish desktop. In short, creating a desktop is much easier than developing a complete distribution. So what are your thoughts on the new Qtfish desktop environment? Let me know in the comments section down below. Thanks for watching my video. This has been KS Kirao. I will see you at the next one.